hello everyone my name is gigo and welcome back to the channel it's another motivational video of building a house in ghana before we begin with today's video i just want to say this to each and everyone who is trying to build a dream house or trying to start a business and feel like giving up because of stress and too much going on please take a short break reflect on whatever you've done learn something new and come back strong this journey is not easy it has never been easy and it is never going to get easy so giving up is not an option so please stay strong keep the dream alive and if not for you do it for your children welcome back to the pram pram project so the last update was the concrete casting of the uh, hidden roof gutters which you see now because we haven't laid a block so you don't see that it is a gutter which was a brilliant question from uh, Bright, from Bright and Clarice channel. He asked me why haven't I, you know, done the block laying, the course for the gutters because now it looks flat. And uh, this is the reason why I will explain that in the video. So if you see now the building now, which you see, the level you see now has two faces. The faces where we are laying blocks now, where the guy is standing now, and also the one with only the beams laid this side which is the only the beam so where the beams are is going to be the roofing that to be the normal roofing we all have and where the blocks are being laid is going to be the rooftop deck so that is that side we're going to cast where the guy is laying the blocks now we're going to cast that side so we have two faces here now we have the decking which will be the normal decking and then we have the roof inside which will be where the beams are so the plan so this answers the question for mr bright if you are watching we're gonna we are laying the blocks where the guy is now because we want to get the level to go with the concrete casting like normally we're supposed to lay blocks to get the whole you know the whole building level we have to get everything leveled before we go with the casting and then the roofing but because of the cash flow else is going to take a lot of money buying and buying another blocks to lay you know it's going to cost so much money so we are going to lay the blocks where the decking will go which i already have that blocks already which is uh, 200 blocks approximately 200 blocks which is from the old blocks that i purchased from mr Quete last three months so we're gonna we only use 1800 blocks to get to this level which is the casting of the beams level and now we're gonna use the remaining 200 blocks to get the decking level the decking uh, site to get to that level then we go we go for the casting then when that is done we can get the level and the slope from the decking to the roof and then from the roof to the gutter i hope this answers your question and it also saves money because if uh, we should lay blocks now we just lay the gutter blocks and then we lay blocks for the hidden uh, for the roofing the normal hidden roofing and then maybe after the decking it won't get that same level and then we have to break some blocks and we have to so the decking come first and then from the decking we take that slope so when it rains on top of the decking it flows to the roof and then from the roof to the gutter so that is the plan and that's how we are also trying to you know to manage the cash flow on the project else i have to be buying a lot of things at the same time and uh, then i'm going to bleed too much charlie it will weak me <laughs> so that's how we try to go step one step at a time and then yeah so this is the journey so far so all of this room is going to be decking like you see and as i always say every windows has a beautiful view with this house because this house is projected to the sea to the environment you know so every windows has a beautiful view and i always say build a lifestyle plan your house take a pen and a paper and draw something so this is the view you get from five to six o'clock six o'clock ish 
you know this is from another this this is the same room eh? the same room but the other side of the windows so this is the view it's not only about the sea view but also about the community you know and for me i i think you know we shouldn't focus only in accra sometimes those villages that we come from you know have a nice view with forest you know with a lake like if you go to the Volta region for instance it's really crazy when it is sunset there because it's a it's a mountainous area ibri uh, so those kind of places also we should try to focus and build something small there you know something that when we go home we feel like we're on a holiday you know it's something private for us you know you you can have a place in Accra outdoor but we should try to build something you know to get away Ghana is very beautiful Ghana is so beautiful Ghana has so many skylines and stuff but we don't pay attention to all of those things we only stay in Accra and the only things we see now are cars and tall buildings and you know we, we don't pay attention to nature if if you're in Accra we don't pay attention to nature but me coming to Prom Prom and paying attention to this community and with the planning of the house I can just talk talk about the whole project like I can just keep on talking explaining things and when the building when the whole structure is done you guys will understand what I mean by building a lifestyle here. You guys will understand the meaning of the structure which I have put in up. It's really crazy. Like seriously, when, when I see it, I'm really happy that I could do something like, like this, you know. This structure, you, cannot, you, you can't find it anywhere in the world. Because this is specially built for this community. This is specially built for this environment. If you take the same plan and you put it somewhere else, it might not fit. You might not have the kind of views this building will give you. That's why I keep stressing. Let's build a lifestyle. If we all build a lifestyle, we we'll make a trademark, you know. So please, let's build a lifestyle. It's very important that we spend the time in building a lifestyle. So work is still ongoing and uh, when the block lane is done, then I will give a breakdown cost of the cost of casting all the beams and also the gutter, the hidden roof gutters. And then uh, the estimate for the decking will also come. The total cost for the full first floor decking was uh, 54,340 Ghana cities. So since this is a, like a half decking, I expect the price to be half with inflation and everything. So let's say roughly 20 to 25,000 should be okay with the decking. And then we see how much the roofing is going to cost with wood and then the roofing sheet. And then we still have to buy some blocks to finish up the gutter and then uh, get the level. So. My next video is going to be about uh, cost breakdown. So subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Please like the video. Let's share this. Let's motivate people to come back home. Check out this view. Sitting in your own house on your rooftop terrace. And enjoying this view. Come on. Let's do this man. It's possible. We can all do this. You don't have to build a story building. Two floors or three floors. Just one level house is enough for you to learn. You know go through the process be tough be strong and opportunities will open up for you it doesn't come easy as i stated in the beginning of the video but when you start the process there are key things in there which will bring joy to you something like this view you see right there these are the little things that when i see it gives me joy and it pushes me to go for more so when you begin with a project those things will also pop up for you that is if you are building a lifestyle if you are building something that you've created the joy will pop up there will be joy somewhere for you so let's start doing something now please take a pen and paper and draw something thanks for watching thanks for staying with me till this far i really do appreciate your time and i will see you in the next episode
Like do we? Take me back to a place where I felt at home Take me back to a day when we weren't alone Take me back to an age when the world felt small Way back